That's us. Sisters wow. share a history. <laughs> I was definitely a cute little girl. <laughs> Melissa, she's the sweet girly girl, the baby of the Otten family. Lisa, she's the outspoken tomboy. You and that haircut. <laughs> and together, their enthusiasm bubbles over. <laughs> but when Melissa and her husband Court tried to start a family, it wasn't easy. Yeah. Um, well, we had a total of nine miscarriages throughout a couple years. Lisa could only listen. It's, it's hard because, and I'm sure I'm not alone in the way women feel about this, but you know, miscarriages are very you know, taboo. Nobody ever wants to speak about them. So you really suffer in silence a lot. The couple considered having another woman carry their baby, sometimes called a surrogate or a gestational carrier. And it actually started as a joke. Being a prankster, Lisa, who's 35, single, and has never been pregnant, offered herself. She tries to make a joke out of everything. So she's like, you know, you can, I'll let you borrow my uterus or something. I can't remember how she phrased it, but, you know, and then she was like, I'm serious. You know, I'll, you know, I'd be happy to carry for you. The three faced a battery of testing, counseling, and legal advice. I passed all the medical tests and the psychological tests with flying colors. They really liked us as a group. Yeah. And they said, you know, <laughs> it sounds weird, but. <laughs> Doctors did an embryo transfer to Lisa, and then the news came. When they did the ultrasound, I was, I told, told the lady, I'm like, count again. <laughs> and she's like, there's two. And I'm like, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, that's a great picture. We've never seen one that clear. No. Lisa is carrying Melissa and Court's twin girls. It was utter disbelief and then uh, terror. We're so incredibly thankful and it's nothing we're ever going to be able to repay. The sisters talk daily and Lisa handles questions. When people come up to me, my favorite thing to say is, don't worry, they're not mine. <laughs> as unconventional as it all might be for a woman to give birth to her nieces. Uh, well, little, you know. squishy thing. <laughs> they've all wrapped their minds around this. In the end, what's important is, is us having kids. It's meant to be. It's crazy. Mm -hmm. I, it gives me goosebumps. We're here now. You know, and we're very, very thankful for where we're at, and we're, we're very blessed.